Hello, my name is Ayan Yasser. I am from Pakistan. You are watching Average High Tech. I know some of you guys kept on asking. Well, guess who's finally here? What is up Titans? I'm Sohail Al Haji. It's Tuesday, January 14th, and you're watching Everyday Titan. I'm not gonna lie, I'm so glad to be your new host. Well, as y'all may know, let's roll right into the news. Operation in Integration will be having a meeting tomorrow, January 15th, in room 8226. Be sure to come. The Leadership Winter Community Service Committee is accepting animal shelter donations in the main office until January 17th. They're accepting slightly used and you and you towels with dog beds along with Vienna sausages and Ziploc bags. The second presentation for the Partners for Safe Teen Driving will take place tomorrow. Please plan on arriving at the auditorium no later than 6.45 p.m. for sign-in. Please bring your parent or guardian and a pen, and please know your student ID number. The Ethiopian and Eritrean Club is meeting tomorrow in B304 to learn how to be involved. Everyone's welcome. If you want to help students register to vote, there is an interest meeting for T.C. Williams Voter Registration Drive in Mr. Orzel's room in B311 after school today. The girls' soccer preseason workouts start next week. Please, please make sure to fill out your paperwork and submit to the VHSL physical and order to participate. The Winter Formal Dance or WINFO is Saturday, January 25th, and tickets will go on sale next week. Before the big dance, the class of 2020 needs your help. Fill out the Google form at the link below to tell the DJ what songs you want at the dance to the event. The form closes tomorrow, so please make sure to go ahead and submit your songs. Speaking of WINFO, send your funny or cute WINFO proposals to tctintv at gmail.com and they might be featured on the show. Judy Woodruff, the, man the managing editor for WETA, a public, a public television station based in Arlington, is coming in today from 12 a.m. to 1 p.m. to speak with government students. Please check out some, some clips from the previous interview to get, a, to, get to know her better. Our main responsibility as moderators is to try to help people understand more about who these candidates are, what their positions are, and so forth. Is this someone we're going to relate to? This is true above all, and that is to remember that these debates are about the candidates. They're not about the moderator or about the questioners. They're about them. And so we're not there to grandstand either. We're, we, it's an obligation that we have to keep our questions short and to the point, uh, and to get the focus as much as possible on the candidates. That's what these debates are all about. Thanks to the advanced TV media production student, Charlotte Despar, for that package. Congratulations to this year's extremely talented T.C. Williams Reflection Art Contest winners. First place winners advanced to the Northern Virginia Regional Reflections co uh, context, Contest next. The award ceremony for the winners is next Wednesday, January 22nd from 9.28 to 9.55 p.m. in the King Street front office. Now let's see what we have going on today in sports.
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you can, please you please tell us in the comment section what, what, what do you want to see next. In the meantime, I'll see you later.